hello guys welcome back to a brand new video today and um, here's my Premier League predictions for week 11 but before I get to that uh, it's been a very bad weekend in the world of football um, so yeah, I've just prepared a little statement um, to say my condolences and that to families that were involved so my thoughts and prayers go out to all the families and friends involved, all, all the people that died in a helicopter crash, uh, which included the Leicester chairman. Um, I'm going to try and not pronounce his name purely because, out of respect, I don't want to muck it up. Um, the family and friends who the Brighton fan that died before the game, um, there's a Brighton fan that died before. Uh, the Brighton Wolves game, um, and obviously that's where I'm from. So you know, it's uh, it's that's a very sad situation as well. Um, I would like to send my best wishes to Glenn Hoddle. Um, make him a, make a speedy recovery. He had a heart attack to in the BT studio. Speedy recovery. Uh, hopefully I like you like the pictures that appear behind me just while I've done that little statement um, obviously it's going to be hard to make this video uh, when something happens in the football world it affects all of us uh, in one way or another um, but anyway guys there's no other way to do this so let's crack on guys you know what to do subscribe for more thanks for watching and let's go Cardiff vs Leicester uh, Leicester away from home uh, this week, uh, going up against a very weak Cardiff side. Um, so, with this one, I'm going to go with a 2 0 Leicester win. Um, Bournemouth versus Man United at the Vitality Stadium. Um, obviously, Man United beating Everton at Old Trafford, whereas Bournemouth are strong at, strong at home anyway. So with this one, I'm going to go with a 2 all scoreline. The next one is Everton versus Brighton. Um, you know, my hometown versus Everton away from home. Um, Everton lost to United, as I've just said. Uh, whereas Brighton beat Wolves 1-0 at the uh, MX. Sorry, it took a while to get it through to my head then. Um, so with this one, I'm going to call it a one-all scoreline. Uh, but I need to start picking points away from home, as well as just doing that at home. Uh, the next one is Newcastle versus Watford. Um, now, Newcastle, very low in confidence. Um, you know, both home and away, as Watford are very high in confidence. So with this one, I'm going to call it a 2-0 Watford win. The next one is West Ham versus Burnley. Now, West Ham, um, you know, doing okay this season. Burnley picking up and now and again and then just dropping. Lost 4-0 to Chelsea, is that going to be a confidence issue for this game? I believe so. So I'm going to go with a 1-0 Leicester win. The next one is probably a game of the weekend. Is Arsenal versus Liverpool. Now, Arsenal draw to Crystal Palace. Liverpool beat Cardiff 4-0. I believe Liverpool are going to win this one and I'm going to go with a 2-0 scoreline. The next one is Wolves versus Tottenham. Now, with Wolves, you know, uh, lose to Brighton as I've said. Spurs has not yet played but I don't think it's going to affect them in any way with this game. So, I'm going to go with a 2-0 Tottenham win. The next one is another team that has a played yet as I'm recording this. Um, Man City versus Southampton. Now yet again I don't think this is going to affect them in any way. 
So Man City, uh, you know, chasing the title. Southampton, as I just, think I just said, very long confidence. So with that one, I'm going to go with a 4 0 Man City win. The next one, a bit of a London derby. I'm not sure how much of a London derby it is. Um, is Chelsea versus Crystal Palace. Um, now Chelsea, I think they're going to win it anyway, uh, being at home. So with that one, I'm going to go with a 2 0 scoreline. Uh, the next one, it, or the last one as well of this fixtures um, is Huddersfield versus Fulham. Uh, Huddersfield uh, really struggling this season. Fulham ain't doing much better. Uh, I think they're up in 18th. It's gonna be a scrappy relegation, uh, but I'm gonna give it to a 1-0 Fulham win. Um, guys, I'm gonna bring this video to an end. Uh, obviously, it might be a bit longer than what I. I know you do it a bit longer given my circumstances why but obviously because of what happened at the weekend I've got to cut this one short that's why I went for them as quick as possible so guys you know what to do subscribe for more thanks for watching ciao for now